Hi guys, this is Lee here. Have you ever thought what to get your friends or family members for the holiday season? Well, in this video, I'm going to go over several things that you can get this holiday season for your sailor friends. So in order to do this, I came to my local shop to where I get all my sunfish parts locally. It's the International Dinghy Shop that's family owned by Jim and Susan Kohler. They've been helping sailors for the last three decades, helping them with sailing and kayaking. And their motto is small boats, lots of fun. If you ever had a chance to come down to Amityville, Long Island in New York, you can come down to the dinghy shop and see Jim or Sue and maybe you could see Digit also. The dinghy shop sells all sorts of small boats like a sunfish, lasers, RS arrows. In addition to sailboats and kayaks, they also sell standard paddle boards. This is Jim. That's not Jim. In addition to being a sailboat and on water business, they also host fall series for optimists and lasers and sunfish. So it's a very popular series where you got 30, 40, or 50 boats. Right now we have Mike here, who is the man here at, at the dinghy shop when Jim Kohler is out here. And he's gonna talk about some of the things that, that I picked out for uh, some of the top 10 things for holiday items. And we have a whole bunch of things here from different price points for mostly sailors, but also for kayakers. So is there anything you want to start out with, Mike? So I'd love to start with the race backpack. This thing is amazing. Uh, you can use it on the boat, on the committee boat, on the bike. You can use this anywhere, anytime, keep everything totally dry. Like I said, it's a backpack, so really easy to move around. So great piece yeah, this for is everybody. Really cool. Yeah. So basically, it's basically a backpack, but because it has this roll up, um, waterproofs. I use a dry bag when I go on my boat, but when, now you have a backpack and uh, something like this, how much does this cost? Uh, they're just under a hundred. And the cool thing too on the sunfish is if you want to bring it with you, it's too big for the cubby, but you can clip it around the mast if you want nice. to hold it in place on the deck. They also have different size sail bags or dry bags that are available online, right? Absolutely. Yeah. Okay, Every great. size you can imagine. All right. So, um, Here's something that's not for sailors. Can you describe what this is? So that is the SEALs cockpit seal. Uh, really great for kayakers. Just like sailors always put top covers on the boats, this is kind of like a top cover for the kayak. Because uh, during winter and fall especially, squirrels love to get in the kayaks and eat all the foam out. So that's a great way to keep all the animals outside. Right, and it also says there's no snakes or spiders. So that, that's, that's good. Oh, yeah. So if you're not a, if you, if you know someone who wants uh, a gift for a kayaker, this, this is a nice gift and um, it's very popular. So you don't have to be digging out raccoons later. Oh yeah. Um, for, for something that I am looking at for a stocking stuffer for a sailor like myself, I just had to, to replace my universal joint. So this is really important, and this is an RWO universal joint, and this is a special one because it has a piece of line in there. So if this does happen to break over, over the next several years, my race won't be messed up because there still is a line there. So this is something really cool. It's, it's not your normal universal joint, and it's all flexible, so it can go in three, 360 degrees. All right, so here we are at the dinghy shop, and we're speaking with Mike, and we're gonna go over the top items that you can get for your holiday shopping season. So the next thing we have is this Stealth Racer watch from Gill. Um, I don't know too much about this. Mike, can you tell me about this? So brand new watch from Gill. It's a nice, really big number face on it. Uh, easy to read in the sun, and it's got a lot of good functions for sailors. So race countdown. This is one of the few watches that you can actually set for a three minute start. Uh, most of them only do a five minute. So really nice piece, uh, great on the water, great on land, great anywhere. Now, does this have a compass? Uh, it does, it has a built-in digital compass. It's probably legal for most dinghy sailing, uh, as long as it doesn't give you GPS information. No, no GPS. GPS, it's just a digital compass. All right, cool, very good. What is really cool for sunfish sailors is the dinghy shop has a special double halyard kit. So I made a video about a gens rig with the two halyards 
And you could get these lines specially made for what I've done on that video. These are very low stretch lines that are correct diameter. And you could order this from the dinghy shop at thedingyshop.com or you can give them a call. You could speak to Mike or Diane or Jim. This is really good so you don't have to think. And they give you instructions in here and they make everything really simple. So this is really cool for the sunfish sailor in your life that you want to give a gift to. So check that out. This is one of my favorite items. When I first started sailing sunfish, I bought a sunfish and I got the spars, the rudder and the dagger board. And I came down and I spoke to Jim. This is about, I don't know, 25 years ago at this point. And I bought one of these, these bags. And this is a really heavy, heavy duty cloth and it has a zipper on it. And the zipper makes all the difference in my opinion and the cloth. I've had this bag for probably 15, 20 years. Those bags are everywhere. These bags are everywhere and they last a really long time. This is, this is like some high quality canvas. It, so this, it fits perfectly for the sunfish spars and you put, you put your sail and your spars, you roll it up and and it protects them. And this is a great bag. Uh, you can get this online at thedingyshop.com. Yep. And um, another trick with that bag, just so you know, the reason it's got a double zip is so you can leave the spars on the boat and just leave yeah. the mast up and zip it in. There you go. So for people who are lucky enough to have their boat next to the water and they don't want to derig their boat 100%, you could protect your sail, which is very expensive, uh, from the sun and the elements, and then you'll you'll have your sun. I mean, your sail lasting for years and years and years. Oh yeah, that's excellent. Thanks a lot, Mike. Now for these hats are kind of new, right? Yes, those are great. Now these are gill hats, and they have UV fifty on them, so they'll protect you from sun. What what else? What's so cool about these hats? So the best part about these hats is it comes with a built-in hat clip that's actually very good. Uh, and since there's no metal in the hat clip, it's not going to rust and leave stains on you or just break during the day. So a uh, big plus for these guys, uh, one hat you will not lose. They have this charcoal and red, yep. and they have a, a navy blue and orange and uh, a Mets colors. Okay, so this is... Diana brought this thing out, and this is kind of like a cool stocking stuffer because if anyone is sailing on Long Island, yeah. or anyone's, <laughs> when the sun goes down, the green flies come out. Oh, yeah. So, so what is this? So don't bug me. We, we've tested this for years to find one that works. Uh, our testing has proved it will work on green flies, but uh, totally natural, which is a nice thing. So uh, no, no side effects, no nothing. Just spray it on. You're good to go. It smells good, too. Uh, but yeah, this actually will keep the green flies away, especially what, like Lee said, when that wind dies, uh, this is what you need. So it also it also repels uh, uh, mosquitoes, mosquitoes and other bugs, yeah. and it is organic. It's USDA organic. So if anyone's uh, scared about any chemicals, this is this is organic. All right. So a couple more things we have. Now, Mike was, was explaining to me about this Ron stand jacket. Now, I use an old guild jacket. It's a spray top, and it's actually kind of my, my, if you ever see my last couple of videos with me wearing a spray top, it's kind of getting uh, worn. So what's, what's new with this Ron stand spray top? So what I really like about the Ron stand is it's a three layer material, which normally you'll see on dry suits or like heavy foul weather gear. Uh, the nice thing is this is a three layer, there isn't that like a uh, white PU lining on the inside that sticks to your skin when you start sweating. Now what is, uh, oh polyurethane. Yep, exactly. Okay. So it's like the white coating you'll see in most spray tops. And that, my polyurethane coating is actually peeling now, so. Yep, so it's, this won't peel. It's much uh -huh. heavier duty, uh, feels a lot nicer on the skin, and it's a little more breathable as well. So, uh -huh. nicer piece, a little heavier duty than the standard smock top that you'll see. Uh, great price, great everything. This is very popular with the juniors. So if you have a junior sailor, uh, an opti sailor, or something sailor, they do have all different sizes for this. So that's that's pretty cool. Oh, yeah. And now it's coming up to the holiday season. The holiday season in the Northeast and up in New England, it gets kind of cold. So you guys down in, in Florida and South Carolina, you, you don't need these things. This is um this is the newest Guild dry suit, right? Yes. So people ask, what is the difference between a dry suit 
and a wetsuit. A wetsuit basically you get wet from the water yep. and then the water heats up next to your body and that's where it insulates you. But a dry suit keeps your whole body except maybe your face and your hands dry and they have these new booties here. Yep. Can, ex can you explain the difference between the old boots and the new booties? So the boots that we're all used to seeing for the most part, on well, the majority of suits out there were always latex. Right. Uh, so they're that black rubbery stuff, but latex is really delicate. So I'm sure anyone who has one of those suits would have replaced the booties a few times by now. Mm -hmm. uh, the fabric booties, much more durable, a bit more comfortable. Uh, they don't get as wet inside like the latex ones do, and then your feet get cold because right. they let some of that moisture out. This is cool. I, I'm curious to see if these are going to be easier to slide in Way in your boots. Yeah, Way because it. I think cloth slides in your 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 dinghy boots better than rubber. Yeah, so, so that will slip into this. Way easier. I bet. And if if you still have your old rubber boots like I do, you could put like a plastic bag on them and slip them. And that's that's a trick of the trade. Oh yeah. But these. These, these suits are really nice. I have a gill that's a couple of years old and, and it's worth every cent because when you fall in the water and you will fall in the water and get, or get wet during the yeah. winter, it's actually dangerous. So um, always wear your PFD. The thingy shop has all like three or four different brands of PFDs oh, yeah. for kayaking, for sailing, for motorboating, for for kiteboarding, for everything. So they have everything online. You could check it out at DeanShop.com. This is this is a nice new, nice new features with these booties. That's really cool. All right. So the last thing I want to talk about, which is probably a great gift for any sailor, especially a sunfish sailor or an optimist sailor, is this. This is a blade bag. This has a dinghy shop blade bag, and not for nothing, once you buy one of these, you'll probably not have to buy one for another 15, 20 years. They're no. really, really good. They're high quality. I've I've had mine for probably 15, 20 years. And you have all this, you have a mesh pocket in here. And why I say it's good for Opti's is because I think you can fit Opti blades in here too, right? So you have Opti dagger board and rudder will fit in here completely shut. Right. And for this, this has a sunfish blade. Sunfish is sunfish blade is not included. Yep. But this is a, a dagger board. This is nice. Um, they also sell class legal parts here. So this is this works. So you could fit your your dagger board and your sunfish rudder, and then the the tiller uh, sticks out, and it's really good to protect it. It's padded. Okay, so this is worth its weight in gold, and this is the Dean Shop. Opti Sunfish Blade Bit, yep. right? Okay, so Mike, uh, if if someone doesn't live on Long Island, how do they how do they buy the stuff? So we ship everywhere. So within the U.S., uh, the Caribbean, and any other country, anywhere you can imagine, we can ship to. We've done it already, no problem at all. Okay, cool. So now, if you want to shop at the dinghy shop and you're remote, you can go on dinghyshop.com. And if you don't see what they have, they have thousands and thousands of items here, all the way to the smallest sailboat piece for your, for your Opti or your Laser or your Sunfish or your RS Arrow. If you don't see it online, give Mike a call, give Diane a call, give Jim a call, and they will find it for you. If they can't find it for you, they'll let you know, and they'll get it out right away, and they ship almost every day, right? Oh, yeah. Okay. You name it, we'll get it there. <laughs> and they will actually ship a boat to you. That's a, now if you can't get a stocking stuffer, a stocking stuffer is the size of a boat. How does that work? Uh, so essentially just give us your address. We'll figure out the best way to get it there, whether it's private transport, cargo, uh, plane, whatever it takes, we'll get it there. Right, that's really interesting because I just sailed down in Florida last week and a few of the boats were from the dinghy shop and I know they don't live in a dinghy shop. So they will get you the boat and they, what's great about the dinghy shop from what I've learned from the past 20 something years that I've been sailing is that they're really supportive of sailors. They're really supportive of the local sailing scene in your area, not just on Long Island. And they help people from upstate and, and in the mid-Atlantic and on the West Coast and in Florida. If you don't know what to get your favorite sailing person or kayaking person for the holiday season, you can also get a gift card, right? 
you can get a gift card, or we even say you can call and speak with one of us, and we'll gladly point you in whatever direction uh, works best for you. The gift cards are always great gifts, and the dinghy shop is going to be uh, able to supply you with your with with stocking stuffers all the way to as large as boats. So, is there anything else you want to add? Yeah, we can get you whatever you need, whatever you need to get under that tree. We can uh, we can get it there. All right, so thanks a lot. And if you got any value from this video, don't forget to smash that like button. We appreciate it.